Welcome back to Old Fire. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the multi desk chair from IKEA. You can purchase this chair for under 20 bucks, so it's not a huge expense, but is it honestly worth it, or should you invest more money into another desk chair? In this review, I'll be answering that question by telling you some of the positives I noticed about this desk chair and some of the negatives. So let's start with some of the good things I noticed. When I opened up the box and started assembling the multi, it took me under 7 minutes to finish off the whole build. Another plus is that cleaning this IKEA chair is very easy as it's made up of reinforced polypropylene. All you have to use is a damp cloth to clean up any mess that you made. I also like that it's very light, so if you're looking to buy a desk chair for your kids, this is another thing you might want to consider. Kids shouldn't really have a problem moving this desk chair around the room. And the legs come with plastic scratch guards, so your floor should stay protected. I tried it out on my laminate floor, and I didn't see any scratches. You also have the option of choosing five different heights you want to sit at. The height of the seat can be easily adjusted by simply taking out this adjustment pin. The highest setting is about 20 inches from the ground to the seat, as the lowest is about 15 inches. Overall, it's a relatively small desk chair, so you shouldn't have any problems fitting it under your desk. It could be a good addition if you don't have a lot of space in your room. But like I said in the beginning, I also noticed some drawbacks, and the main one has to do with the comfort level. I was testing it out for about 10 to 15 minutes, and I already started to notice some discomfort in my lower body. I'm thin, so that could be a factor, but I tend to be at my desk for about 3-4 to four hours daily, and from the looks of it, this desk chair wouldn't make that experience pleasant. I noticed that the backrest has some flexion to it, and the shape of it forces you to sit up straight. This is a good thing, as when I tried slouching down, like I would normally do when working at my desk, I found that position to be less comfortable. You would also think that this desk chair comes with the option to swivel back and forth, but unfortunately, it doesn't. When you're done working at your desk, you'll always have to lift the desk chair back and turn your whole body to one side to get out of it. Another thing I noticed when I was sitting on the chair is that there was some movement of the seat, but I found the legs to be pretty stable. IKEA states that the multi-chair has been tested for up to 243 pounds or 110 kilograms, but I wouldn't think that people of larger stature would find this desk chair suitable. I'm six feet tall and found that the highest setting to be the most comfortable. The lowest settings really look like they're intended for short adults or kids. In my opinion, if you have kids and are looking for a desk chair that's really cheap, then it's not a bad purchase. Kids generally don't really care that much about comfort, but if you're an adult that intends to sit at your desk for more than 30 minutes, I would look for something more comfortable. Smash that like button if you enjoyed the video, and screw that subscribe button if you want to see more furniture review videos.